with the exception of uh, Mr. Uh, Dr. White and Mr. Valdez, you managed to studiously avoid the issue that hundreds of people from the Education Coalition have come to these meetings about. You said the Council on American Islamic Relations was only in one class. Then it was several classes in one school. The CAIR Florida website says at least three K through 12 schools in Hillsborough County. You said other speakers had been in the class to teach about other religions. Then it became other speakers had been invited. Now it appears that after this issue bubbled up, one was scheduled but never showed. You said it was to teach the tenets of Islam. One of the CARE representatives and the CARE Florida website says it was to dispel misunderstandings about Muslims and to teach about CAIR civil rights efforts. So here's the situation. You've had hundreds of people show up who are concerned because representatives of an organization that has been linked to terrorism in a federal trial have been allowed into our classrooms to indoctrinate our children about the misconceptions about Muslims and about CAIR's civil rights work. It's in your power to end this controversy. All you need to do is actually address the issue that's uh, the root of our concern. We don't want organizations that have been linked to terrorism funding in a federal trial and whose stated goal is to replace the U.S. Constitution with Sharia law to be invited to be in our class. And uh, Mr. Shipley said I was a liar on his uh, blog, but he was unable to provide any evidence. I can provide evidence for everything that I've said in every meeting that we've had, if you would care to look at it. Thank you, Mr. Kimball. Ali Muhammad. Ali Muhammad. Tom Earl. Greetings. My name is Tom Earl. I'd like to thank you for this opportunity to speak. I want to invite us to reflect upon 